pi in circumference. So circumference is just another word for the perimeter around a circle. So it's just the edge all the way around it. So we're going to draw a few circles and do a little bit of investigation. So let's say the diameter of this circle was two centimeters, the diameter of this one was four centimeters, and the diameter of this one was six centimeters. So if you drew these circles with a compass and measured all the way around them with like a piece of string and then measured the string, you'd find you'd get the circumference of this one being about 6.28 centimeters. So this is the distance all the way around. This one you get about 12.57 centimeters. And this one you get 18.85 centimeters. Now, what we're going to do now is take the circumference and divide it by the diameter for all of them. So 12.57, the circumference divided by the diameter of 4, and 18.85 divided by its diameter of 6. And if you put those in the calculator, you'll get 3.14, 3.14, and 3.14. Well, that's pretty interesting, because they're all 3.14. And you might recognize that 3.14 is about what pi equals. And this is what, where pi comes from. It's the relationship between a circle's diameter and its circumference. And now we have a formula for the circumference of a circle, where the circumference equals pi times the diameter. So let's find the circumference of a circle. So if we know the diameter of a circle, is 8 meters, what's its circumference? Well, we can use our formula. Circumference equals pi times its diameter, which is 8. And just using a calculator, we're going to get 25.1 meters to one decimal place. Let's do one more. So this time, we're only given the radius is 6 centimetres. There's another formula we can use for the circumference, and that equals 2 times pi times r, or just 2 pi r, because you don't have to write the multiplication signs. And that makes sense, because when you multiply the radius by 2, you actually get the diameter. So this one's going to be 2 times pi times the radius, which is 6. 2 times 6 is 12. Still need to times it by pi. And that's going to give us 37.7 centimetres to one decimal place.